I know that was a Tristana, but I don't want it. I don't wanna. Second Lulu. Three out of four. We just put in Needle. She's good enough. Yeah, we have an insane start, to be honest. We have an insane start. Now we're at 100% HP, so we're gonna get the last slim pickings from here. And I don't think we get anything that is super useful right now. Two bows. Uh, where are we? Here. We have a bow right now. Armor would be nice. AP drop, of course, would be nice. I mean, AP deal, though. Ah, oh, my god. Bro. Alright, I'm gonna take the tear drop then. Shaman Oloibolo. Oloibolo. Sell this, put this guy in. Not a needle. I have one Warwick here. It's a little bit awkward, not gonna lie. But I put this guy in. Sell the one Garen. Want to maintain the win streak. How does red buff stack? Like each time you attack, it refreshes to the start, like to the to the durability or what? I don't really understand it. Don't really understand that part. I guess we can sell those. Full house. Second like League of Legends, Dota refreshes with every auto attack. So it has like a duration of, I don't know, two seconds or something. And it refreshes with every single time. I guess we're not maintaining that win streak, unfortunately. Do that. All right, we need one needly. One needly. One vein. All right. I'm trying to get parent home office starting on 10th of July to have more time to work on videos. Lul. Any bonus of maintaining win streak? Yes, you get more gold. You get one gold for winning, but if you get a win streak, you get two gold or three gold at the end. Which is pretty insane. I 
That's Seraph. Unfortunately, that's something that is, doesn't work. So, I still believe TFT will be on the start of the new patch. Maybe, man. Let's hope so. Let's hope so. Okay, we get Lulu. And buy a guarantee. Should have put a second one. That's okay though. Lulu is so annoying, holy shit. Lulu is so annoying, holy shit, man. What did you have the most success with so far? Four wilds. 100%, man. Very powerful. Zali, witam na kanale, tylko pamiętaj, że witam mówi tylko gospodarz. Are you playing as a professional player? I did start with Hearthstone. Now I'm more... I mean, I'm still a pro Fortnite player. Uh, but we're looking into this game very, very, very much. Oh my god, are you serious right now? Nah. Shit. Dude. You have to be kidding me. Let's win this, please. So I don't feel like a moron. Alright, GG. The first damage is the playing on first hit. Oh, so the faster you attack, the more damage you do. So play. Oh, fuck my life, man. And there's a Sejuani here. Oh god. You sleep a Fortnite off stream? Yes, I do. In CSGO, fight with Bialy would be harder. I can actually 1v1 him. 100%. And it won't be that far away. Rip. Oh, I could have chosen something. Oh, shit. Unlucky, man.
Maybe I should have went for the Phantom Dance of Vein. Although Lulu is just so goddamn impressive, man. We have like ultra carries right now. What the chicken is doing? It's just. <laughs> We're just doing voices, man. Like mine. <laughs> Ooh, did you see? <laughs> oh my god, what a combo. Okay, let's try it this way. Play with Wicked TV. Weak Ludo ult. Unfortunately. But we're okay. He gets destroyed. Do we even need Aries? We actually kind of do because we have two sources right now. So it wouldn't be bad. So wait, uh, did I read correctly? Uh, let me check. Uh, so, someone who plays LOL a lot. If I shoot faster with red buff, do I deal more damage? Because it gets restacked, so it starts over and over and it starts ticking with the first hit. No? No, it's it's not about stacking, right? But it applies damage on hit? Or does it happen after the hit? That's my question. It's not I'm no I know it's not stacking. Sometime some time ago it was on a hit. Because it just reset the timer. Okay, but when does it start ticking? Does it tick instantly as a hit? Oh, so the first hit... Okay, and then it's not being... I think I understand. Shit, noble buff. Lul. Good damage, bro. Tactical nuke deployed. The first shot for sure, yes, but then the next one, I don't know. Okay. It's an interesting situation, right? Because if it's... If it applies... To the next one. And that's actually fantastic. I would say. So we have three sources right now. Two rangers, two wild. We're one wild off full combo. So we need we need uh Mr. Nar. We need Mr. N Mr. Nar. That would be Gucci. On the bench we have the stun combo. Which is not good enough right now. Blade Master on Vayne. Interesting. Oh god, Bialko just got demolished. Holy shit. Give me like five minutes. I'm starting low. We'll check that. Okay, thank you, bro. First damage for Red Velvet is hitting exactly on the moment of hitting out of attack, but next got on timers, and you're only refreshing red buff by attacking. Okay. Well that's disappointing then. So the faster so the faster you shoot, you don't deal more damage. 
Phantom Sorcerer. Do you even want to buy it? If we get Kindred... Nah, man. Doesn't make any sense. Nuke deployed, killed Brand. Holy shit. Ah! No way. That red buff on um, Warmog though, man. So important. Not a card. Is, what, what, what items do we have? Armor would be good for Phantom Dancer. AP drop would be as okay. Shojin would be good too. Lul, there's Zeki here. I'm just taking that instead, lol. Two items, basically. Last pick got Zeki's, man. We don't have enough gold. 32, 35, 39. Not enough. We do want to put Zeke's on. On Nar, right? We're gonna put it on Nar. That's our beefiest creature. So, next round, we're gonna level up to 8 and put Nar in. Now, Kaz wants to get the, the attack speed from Zeke's. Oh, shit. Well, that was way worse. all the tactical nukes. Dude, he got absolutely smashed. And Nar didn't even go to his ultimate. Chogat... We don't really have anything here. So I'm gonna keep it as it is, I guess. I mean, we need more Nars. That's what we need. Nagatron Cloak. That's for Phantom Dancer. That's pretty good too. Hush. Wouldn't be terrible. No one is playing viruses. So this is an option. What do you want to do with Negatron Cloak? Zephyr would be nice. 
Uh, we want Nar to live, so we're going to put him on him. Nar is the important part of the puzzle. Puzzle. Okay, let's see. Just check, you apply red dealing its damage on first hit, then for the next two seconds, target gets two ticks of damage. You reapply red with every AA, but first hit them, it doesn't apply. Okay, good to know, thank you. Shit. Good job of ours. Oh my god, dude. What is this vein? Do you want to... Hmm. Let's do it this way. This should be better. Yeah, we had Warwick AFK because I thought we might actually meet someone with an assassin. You know? That's okay, though. Warwick heals 3% of the maximum health per second. But Red Buff is stopping that. It's good. Now versus now. GG Kwon. I don't need the Ash though. I need Nars. I don't need Ash. That was a mistake. Did you repair this fan? Not yet. I'm gonna do that after the stream. What if we put Kindred instead of Nar? What if we do that? Nar MVP knocked him out of Kindred ult. <laughs> Kindred instead of Vayne, maybe? It's also a possibility. What do I have here? No Nar. Shojin would be nice. Selvain go with Kindred. Seems okay. Put Phantom Dancer on Varus. Or him. Let's go for Kindred. Okay, never mind. We put it on Varus anyway. Good, because he's countering those. <laughs> those assassins can hit him, man. Oh, that's hilarious, bro. That's absolutely hilarious. Oh, it's 200 IQ play, man. 200 IQ play. A Wicked and Nerva. Alright, so one of us is gonna win. Alright, what are the setups? They have Chogat. Very important to... Oh, Ecop is alive still, too. Alright, this, this guy is very important in here. He needs to get that Garen in. 
Let's see. Okay, different setup. Glacials. That's a Giovanni though. It's gonna be a problem. We need to figure out something against him. We need to figure out something against him. Ecop's dead. <sighs> we need to put Varus in a different corner than the rest of us. Basically, that's what we need to do. But what about Nervarian then? Hmm. Let's see. Dude, that's glacial. That is glacial. That is sick. Right now. What is this? Bronze Hurricane. The Zephyr. Fuck. Zephyr more important. Come on, Kindred, all to ourselves. Now oh, we're against the clone. Wicked is left. Alright. Is that the glacial? It is. Where's Draven? Here. Zephyr goes here. Draven goes here. He gets effort. No, what? Fuck. Mirror image. Oh, my bad. Oh, my God. I'm stupid. What the fuck? Oh, my God. I threw the game, man. I threw the game. 37 damage, bro. GG wicked, I guess. But I threw the game. I threw the game. What is the damage based upon? Tier 1 gives 1 damage, tier 2 gives 2 damage, tier 3 gives 3 damage. Uh, and then the character deals 2 damage as well. And the mobs deal 1 damage too. Alright, wicked. We can choose Zephyr target? Yes, it's mirror positioning, but I... Uh, I fucked it up, man. I fucked it up. That's insanely useful. It is, but you need to actually use your brain and see where's the mirror image. If I would actually put Nar on the hex, which would 
um, Zephyr the Draven, I would have probably won. Because that's five seconds where Draven doesn't hit anything. Dude, I'm so mad at myself right now. It's not even about the subs, because that doesn't matter. But if I, the fact that I could have won that game so easily, in my opinion, you know? It was very close to just winning the game by just making that one change.